Meta. Today we are going to talk about friendship and learn how to make new friends. <gasps> First, what is a friend? Well, a friend is someone that you care about. A friend is someone that you like to be with. A friend is someone that plays with you and laughs with you. A friend is someone that talks with you and listens to you. Meta is my friend. Mm -hmm. A friend is also someone that you share things with and take turns with. You may share your toys, your crayons, or maybe even your books with your friends. At the playground, you may take turns swinging on the swing or take turns going down the slide with your friends. A friend is also someone that you like doing fun things with. Isn't that right, Meta? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You might like making art together, building blocks together, or playing dinosaurs with your friends. Now, I must tell you, friends don't always have to agree on everything. Mm. You can like different things, and you can have different opinions and different feelings about things and still be friends. For example, Meta thinks the best ice cream flavor is strawberry, mm -hmm. but I think the best ice cream flavor is chocolate. <gasps> That's okay that we both think differently. It's what makes us uniquely different. Mm. You don't have to like all the same things or do all the same things or be the same in order to be friends. Now, friends do need to be kind to each other. Let's think of some things that you can do to be a kind friend. Hmm. Oh, I know. You could offer to help your friend clean up their toys after you are done playing with them during a play date. Or maybe if you see a friend fall down on the playground, you could go over to them and help them back up. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Or maybe your friend is sad. You could simply tell them a funny joke to make them laugh. And if they want one, you could give them a hug. Those are all things you can do to be a kind friend. Ooh. <gasps> That's Miss Y calling. Hi, Miss Y. Hi, B. I just wanted to call and say that I really enjoy being friends with you and Meta. We were just talking about friendship. Mm. Oh, Meta just asked a great question. Why is Miss Y friends with us? Oh, that is a great question. Why am I friends with Meta and B? Well, that is a really easy question to answer. I'm friends with Meta and B because you both are so kind to me. I like being around you two, and you both are really good listeners when I need someone to talk to. Does that answer your question, Meta? Mm-hmm. Well, thanks again, Meta and B, for being my friend, and have a great rest of your day. Well, thank you, Miss Y, for being our friend. Bye. Bye. Mm -hmm. That was Miss Y, our friend who is a scientist at the Curiosity Lab in the city. Meta, from time to time, it's really nice to let your friends know that you enjoy being their friend. Mm. What's that? Mm. Oh, Meta just asked another great question. How do you make friends? That is a great question to ask, Meta. Do you hear that? It sounds like a superhero is flying through the air. <gasps> Meta, look! Mm. Shh. It's Meta's favorite superhero stuffy, Mimi the Orange Fox. Mimi's superpower is spreading kindness all over the world. Mm. Mimi, I bet you are here today to help us learn how to make friends. <gasps> I knew it! Okay. We can use Mimi to role play making new friends. First, start with a hello and introduce yourself. Then ask them, what is their name? Like this, hello, my name is B. What is your name? Then listen to what they say. Then ask them another question like this. Would you like to be my friend? Then listen again to what they say. 
and then ask them another question like this. Would you like to go play tag? Or would you like to go share my blocks and build something? Mm -hmm. And finally, always remember to be kind. <gasps> Mimi, would you like to role play me asking you to be my friend? Mm -hmm. Yes. We're going to pretend we don't know each other. Okay, here we go. Hi, my name is B. What is your name? Oh, hi, Mimi. Would you like to be my friend? You would? Hey, would you like to go play tag? Awesome, I'm so excited. Let's go play tag, Mimi. We did it. That was really fun. Now you know how to make friends. What if we see a friend that is alone and looks lonely? What can we do to be kind and helpful? Hmm. Well, if you know them, you could simply go sit next to them or offer to play a game with them. Mimi, would you like to role play again to practice that? Yes. Okay, Mimi, you will be the friend that is sitting alone at the playground, and I'll be the friend that notices you. Okay, let's start pretending. Hi, Mimi. Do you mind if I sit next to you? Okay. Thanks. Do you want to play a game of tag? Okay, let's go play tag, Mimi. Ah, wow, that was wonderful. Okay, now let's pretend we don't know each other. This is what you could say and do. Hello, my name is B. Would you mind if I sit next to you? All right, what's your name? Mimi? That is a really cool name. Nice to meet you, Mimi. Would you like to be my friend, Mimi? We could go swing on the swings. Would you like to do that? Wow, again, that was wonderful. Now you know what to do if you see a friend that is alone and looking lonely. I have to add, not everyone will want to play. That's why we have to ask and listen to what they say. Also, going up to a friend may be hard to do at first, but as you get the hang of it, you will be helping others feel included, helping them feel like they belong, and letting them know that they too have a friend that they can play with, laugh with, and just do fun things with. Today we learned what is a friend, how to make new friends, and what to do if we see a friend who is alone and looking lonely. Do you know what time it is? Mm -hmm. It's time to dance. This is where we stop what we're doing, stand up and dance. You can do whatever dance move you feel like doing. <gasps> do you hear that? Mm -hmm. It's the idea train. <gasps> and look, it's Pinky the Boom Box. Hi, Pinky the Boom Box. All right. Thank you, idea train. Mm -hmm. All right, we will put Pinky the Boombox right here. Pinky plays our music. I will take this gold cassette tape and put it in here. And I will close it up and push the button with the triangle on it, the play button. Are you ready to dance? Mm -hmm. Yes? Okay, I will push the play button now. was a lot of fun. Let's get back to what we were doing. Guess what? It's time to share some Meta art. Mm -hmm. 
This is a map of the world. The colorful shapes on this map represent all the different places we live on our planet. The first piece of art we are going to share today was sent to us by a family who lives in the United States of America in the state of New Jersey. An awesome kid named Anna made this Meta art. Wow, look at that, Meta! Anna made a beautiful rainbow. She used the colors red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, and pink. And look, Meta, there you are on top of the rainbow. And next to Meta is Mr. Butterfly. Anna, nice job on your handwriting. Over here, Anna wrote my name, B. And over here, Anna wrote Meta's name, M-A-Y-T-A, -A, Meta. And way down here, Anna wrote her name, A-N-N-A, -N -N -A, Anna. Anna, thank you for sending us your fantastic Meta art. The next piece of art we're going to share today was sent to us by a family who lives in Canada. An amazing kid named Anthony made this Meta art. Anthony, you did a great job drawing all of our friends. I see Pinky the Boombox down here and Miss Y right here. Hey, Meta, look! There you are right here. And next to Meta is Bolty the Robot. I see me, B, right here. Mr. Butterfly is flying over my head and next to B is Meta's little baby sister, Gigi. I love your trees and the idea train down here. Anthony, I love how you used so many different colors for each of us. Thank you, Anthony, for sending us your magnificent Meta art. And the last piece of art we're going to share today was sent to us by a family who lives in Vietnam. A cool kid named Anna made this Meta art. Anna, you have the same name as Anna from New Jersey who drew our first Meta art. How cool is that? Anna, I love how you drew all of us. We have Mr. Butterfly over here, and next to Mr. Butterfly is me, B. Next to B is Meta, and next to Meta, Anna drew herself. And next to Anna is Miss Y. Anna, I love how you spent a lot of time drawing each of us. You can really see the different expressions on each of our faces. I like how you closed one of your eyes to show us that you are winking. It really gives a lot of personality and fun to your self-portrait. I love your beautiful yellow sun in the sky, your clouds, and your bright green grass. Anna, thank you for sending us your fantastic Meta art. Before we go, let's say five good things about ourselves. Do you want to do that? Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay, I'll go first, and then you repeat what I say after me. Number one, I am strong. Number two, I am helpful. Number three, I am smart. Number four, I am brave. Number five, I am kind. Wow, that was really great. Nicely done. To keep learning with Meta, me, and all of our friends, make sure to hit the subscribe button below. Thank you for spending your time with us, and until next time, bye!